than 1.9 billion Muslims around the world consider Ramadan as the greatest month of the entire year. But do you know why? Come, let us explore Ramadan, the greatest month. Ramadan literally means scorching heat. It is the ninth month of the Islamic year. It begins by sighting of the new moon. It is the month that brings happiness, blessings and forgiveness. Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him said, When Ramadan comes, the gates of paradise are opened and the gates of the fire are closed and the devils are chained. Meaning, doing good becomes easier than usual and doing evil becomes difficult than usual. Ramadan develops the spirit of closeness with the Creator as it builds the spiritual environment which encourages Muslims to perform good deeds. Ramadan is the greatest month primarily because the glorious Quran was revealed in it to Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him as a guidance for humanity. As Allah Almighty says in the Quran, شهر رمضان الذي أنزل فيه القرآن هدى للناس هدى للناس وبينات من الهدى والفرقان The month of Ramadan is that in which was revealed the Qur'an, a guidance for the people and clear proofs of guidance and criterion. In Islam, the glorious Qur'an is the primary source of knowledge. Allah Almighty revealed the first five verses of the Qur'an in the cave Hira in the month of Ramadan. As Allah Almighty says, اقرأ باسم ربك الذي خلق خلق الإنسان من علق اقرأ وربك الأكرم الذي علم بالقلم علم الإنسان ما لم يعلم Recite in the name of your Lord who created Created man from a clinging substance. Recite, and your Lord is the most generous, who taught by the pen, taught man that which he knew not. The glorious Quran is the final book of guidance meant for humanity until eternity preserved by the Almighty. Ramadan is the month in which fasting has been made an obligation upon the Muslims with an objective to gain piety. As Allah Almighty says in the Quran, <laughs> O you who have believed, decreed upon you is fasting as it was decreed upon those before you that you may become righteous. The Messenger of Allah, peace and blessings be upon him, said, Whoever does not leave evil words and deeds while fasting, Allah does not need him to leave food and drink. The unique feature of fasting 
in the month of Ramadan observed by the Muslims around the world is doing iftar together as families, as societies and as humanity at large. For Muslims, zakah, charity is a duty and a pillar of Islam. Therefore, they take great care and give 2.5% from their annual savings, especially in the month of Ramadan, to gain greater rewards. Allah Almighty says regarding charity in the Quran. <laughs> O oh, you who have believed, spend from that which we have provided for you. Muslims also focus on giving their voluntary charity in the month of Ramadan as it is highly rewardable. In Ramadan, Muslims pay great attention on prayers as it is quite visible in the masjid, which receives overwhelming response. It is also highly recommended to offer voluntary prayers in Ramadan for it revives the relationship with the Creator and prevents from wrong and immoral behavior. As Allah Almighty says, Indeed, prayer prohibits immorality and wrongdoing, and the remembrance of Allah is greater, and Allah knows that which you do. Ramadan is an amazing month to gain purity in faith and character as it provides consistent programming towards goodness. Ramadan provides an opportunity for the believers to deeply reflect and revive their purpose of life and that is to worship Almighty and benefit humanity. Muslims spend quality time in repenting for their sins to Almighty as Ramadan is the month of mercy and forgiveness. Muslims also intensify their supplications, du'as, in the month of Ramadan as sincere supplication is a powerful means to get closer to Allah Almighty as mentioned in the Quran there is a special reward of performing Umrah in the month of Ramadan. For this reason, Muslims who have the means and the ability to perform Umrah are highly encouraged to do so. Remembering Almighty is a way to revive faith for the Muslims, especially in the month of Ramadan. And they remember Allah Almighty through praying and praising and by performing good deeds that can help oneself and humanity. The incentive of remembering Almighty is contentment and satisfaction as Allah Almighty says in the Quran. Those 
بذكر الله ألا بذكر الله تطمئن القلوب In the month of Ramadan there is the greatest night it is called as Laylatul Qadr the night of power or decree Allah Almighty revealed the glorious Quran in this night which is better than 1000 months as it is mentioned in the Quran Inna anzalnahu fi laylatil qadr wa ma adraka ma laylatul qadr laylatul qadr khayrun Indeed, we sent it, the Qur'an, down during the night of decree. And what can make you know what is the night of decree? The night of decree is better than a thousand months. Laylatul Qadr, night of power or decree, is found in one of the odd nights in the last 10 days of Ramadan. Muslims strive to seclude themselves in the masjid with an intention to observe i'tikaf, literally means seclusion. They do their best to spend special moments remembering Almighty, aiming to get closer and closer to Him. Ramadan is the ultimate month of programming towards goodness and helps to abstain from bad deeds. This systematic and consistent programming towards goodness enables them to achieve life transformation experience. Muslims end their fasting by sighting of the new moon of the month of Shawwal, which is the tenth month of the Islamic year. Muslims feel great sense of achievement and happiness after completing their fasts and other types of worship in the month of Ramadan and celebrate Eid al-Fitr. On this day, every individual Muslim, rich and the poor, gives out something out of joy and happiness. Ramadan leaves a life-changing experience for the believers and deeply impacts their physical, social, economical, psychological and most importantly spiritual well-being may you all live upon the guidance of the almighty with peace progress and prosperity Ooh.